Hey, film bugs! Today I'm reviewing the latest version of Mortal Kombat, which is now out in theaters and streaming on HBO Max. Let's begin! After seeing the trailer that came out some time ago, I was excited to see the reboot of this movie. I was a fan of the 1995 original Mortal Kombat, but not so much the sequel, Mortal Kombat Annihilation. There were also previous TV series and some other movies before this one. This version of Mortal Kombat is directed by Simon McCoy, written by Greg Rousseau, and screenplay by Dave Callahan. The movie stars Louis Tan as Cole Young, Jessica McNeely as Sonya Blade, Josh Lawson as Kano, Joe Taslim as Sub-Zero, Mikad Brooks as Jax, Hiroyuki Sanada as Scorpion, Sissy Stringer as Melina, and Chin Han as Shang Tsung. So what is the synopsis? Well, Earthrealm is on the verge of catastrophe. The Outworld has already won nine straight tournaments, and in one more win they will be able to take over mankind since there's no other champions to defend it. But an ancient prophecy foretells that a new group of champions will be united to save the world from the Outworld. The effects are great. This is definitely an R-rated movie because the games are definitely known as violent and there's plenty of gore. I just wish it had a much better storyline. Most of the film was a mess because of the current switching between character, backstories, and fight scenes. I did have some doubts about this movie when I heard that they're introducing a new character. The problem with that is that Mortal Kombat already has a lot of great characters, and the film has a good cast. I especially liked the characters Sub-Zero, Scorpion, and Raiden in this movie. These characters should have been top billing, and, and I feel they should have focused on the three. Too much time was spent focusing on the new characters and building up their backstories. Most of the characters were not well developed. This could have worked if they made this movie more of a mini-series and they'd give proper character development and build up their backstories. The fight scenes. There are two or three good fight scenes. I will not spoil those for you. There are some fight scenes that felt a bit rushed. I would have rather that they had less fight scenes that were well choreographed than putting together something that was rushed and poorly choreographed. The fatalities would have been more impactful if the battle or fight was well done. Acting was just okay. Kudos to John Lawson as Kano, John Tosselum as Sub-Zero, and Hiroyuki Sonata as Scorpion for their standout performances. Shin Han was fine as Shang Tsung, but for me there's only one Shang Tsung, and that's Kari Hiroyuki Tagawa. What about you? What do you think was, were, the standout performances in this movie? In conclusion, I'm giving the Mortal Kombat 2021 movie a 6 out of 10. It was entertaining. There are a couple good one-liners. As mentioned earlier, the story could have been better developed. It would have been a good idea to cut out the new character and focus primarily on Scorpion and Sub-Zero. Or maybe even actually have a tenth tournament happening in the movie. I know it's really remaking the original 1990 film movie, but I don't think there's anything really wrong with rebooting. Everyone seems to be doing it nowadays anyway. I streamed this on HBO Max, which is fine. If I was given a choice of streaming this or seeing this in the movie theaters, I'd probably just stream it. Otherwise I would have waited to rent it and watch it on demand. Don't let this discourage you from seeing it. You may enjoy it. If you're a fan of Mortal Kombat movies and games, I'd say watch it, but don't have any expectations. There are plenty of gory fatalities and a few great fight scenes, which is what the franchise is known for. Please let us know your thoughts on the movie in a comment below. Before I go, I'd like to say I appreciate all of you that have viewed, liked, and subscribed our channel. So until next time, film bugs, flicker on. This episode is brought to you by the Mortal Kombat Tournament. When? I don't know. Where? I have no idea. Can I go? Only if you're invited. Prove yourself and win. Or... Your soul is mine! The Mortal Kombat Tournament of Champions. Finish him!